This is calculator question number one from the April 2019 SAT. College Board gives us a linear equation and asks us to solve for x. The easiest way to solve is to go to your graphing calculator, TI-83, TI-84, or some other graphing calculator, and put the left side of the equation y1, right side y2, choose an x window that includes all your answer choices, and then find the intersection on my calculator, that second trace, choice 5 is intersect, and then I hit three, enter three times without looking at where I am, and it says x equals negative 4. My graph looks like this. I can see, even though the intersection isn't on my y window, I can see that the intersection will be someplace where x is negative, and so choice A would be the correct answer. If I wish to do that algebraically, it can also be done by hand. Distribute the 5. 5 times x is 5x. 5 times negative 3 is negative 15 equals 10x plus 5. Subtract 5x from both sides, and I get negative 15 equals 5x plus 5. Subtract 5 from both sides. Negative 15 minus 5 is negative 20 equals 5x. Since x is multiplied by 5, I'm going to divide by 5. If I divide the right-hand side by 5, I'll also divide the left-hand side by 5. Always do the same thing to both sides of any equation. So 5 over 5 is 1. x equals negative 20 over 5 is negative 4, which your calculator can tell you that if you prefer not to do mental arithmetic. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.